All right, guys, today I'm going to show you guys the best builds, runes, and playstyle when you play Jax top lane in the new patch. So what you want to run right now is Conquer, Triumph, Alacrity, Last Stand, Biscuit Delivery, and the Time Warp Tonic. And along with this entire setup, you want to run a Corrupting Pod on Jax. This is extremely important because you're going to combine the Corrupting Pod along with Time Warp Tonic, giving you that insane sustain for the laning phase. Now, <laughs> I'm so impressed, guys. Jack's top lane is currently running on a insane steady 51% win rate, which is actually considered to be one of the highest win rates of top lane right now, along with a few other champions. If you're looking into, you know, playing that perfect top laner now, which is hardly being touched by... Uh, riot at all i would definitely encourage you to play Jax. like i'm going to show you this game what this champ is capable of we're going to specifically be running the blade build and then going into define sunner to really like maximize the potential of Jax. also we're up against a grace which is kind of a interesting matchup i wouldn't say the hardest matchup but he's definitely designed to poke you out of lane and Making you, you know, giving you that horrible <laughs> play new face, right? So we're gonna have to be uh, avoiding uh, Grace for a bit. Hopefully we're not gonna miss too much. Okay, good. So we just got level 2 now. I'll see if I can actually get like a little bit of a push going against Grace now. I don't want this guy to hard push it into me. But also remember, they have a Kane as their Joner. Let's pop in the combo. We still have like two pots. I mean three. Ready for battle. Hmm. Just popping the combo in. Oh. I got him. Although I'm probably going to die here. If I get my Q in time... Okay, <laughs> we are live. It actually turned out pretty well. So what we're going to run now is immediately going for Blade. Now, I've been recommending this for a while now. If you're looking for that perfect laning, I definitely suggest you guys going for a Blade right now. Um, skipping the Mythic item for later. You definitely do not want to rush a Trinity Force right now or a Defiant Sunner, even though it looks really, uh, looks really good to buy. And it is really good. Blade of the Rune King is definitely the reason why Jax is so strong right now. Because it gives you that early game power spike that you want, right? So. It's on. Let's go back to this guy. We're going to be training the same way again. Uh, Got to be careful though. The wave is currently in a pretty awful position. We got to at least wait for a little bit for the wave to push in. Okay. Now, as for the complete new Jax players, <laughs> I know you guys are always here. Um, in case you're unaware, uh, you always want to max out your W, first of all, which is, yeah, I guess everyone knows that now. Uh, but uh, after maxing your W, you have the option whether you max Q or E. And if I can give you a little bit of help with that, you max your Q when you are playing against matchups that constantly jump. So think of a champion like Riven as, as an example. You want to have your Q being maxed after W because you want to keep on being able to chase, right? Get yourself that mobility. And if you are in a very, very hard matchup, one that you cannot face pretty well, that's where you max E after W. So that's, like, that's generally like the way how you want to think. walking away sure my q is going to come back in just a tiny second right now we might be able to get a catch here i'm going to ping top lane and ask for a dive right now i hope that my volibear is going to walk around and at least try to dive him because this guy is absolutely dive worthy i hope he's going to be here he should be here He's actually walking his way back. 
Oh, okay. Well, we can probably stop him. I'm just going to send out the cause to my Joiner to stay right now. Because we can probably get a... Get an easy catch on that Graves. Hold on a second. We're going to force some stuff here. Yeah, he's very well aware of... Uh, of the, yeah, he's very well aware of this. We stop him again. And we got him. You see like what I'm trying to do here? Okay, not bad. I was thinking about turning, but uh... That's pretty good, actually. Sure. You see what I'm trying to do here, guys? Jax is not just a champion designed to play safe. Like, we want to play with fire here, man. We, we want to constantly sit in the face of this Graves, you know? Constantly giving him that pressure. Even when he decides to go back to base, we just sit, like, between the two towers and we make the call, right? Um... Like, I don't want you guys just to play top lane, and that's it. I want you guys to actively ping your jungler and make the calls, right? Just like I did right here. I was constantly pinging Volibear, like, come over here, take this camp, you know, help me out with this stuff here. Because if Graves comes in, we can kill him when he walks to the lane, right? If I didn't make those calls, Volibear would have walked here and we would just start farming. So, you want to make the calls to get things going, you know? At least give it a try. Some jungleners, they absolutely hate playing with you. Just letting you know if you're going to do this. You know, some some uh, junglers just refuse to do anything. But at least I'd say just try. You know, just try pinging your jungler and making things work, you know. Like 50% chance, like some, some, uh, some of the time, jungleners don't want to help you. 50% roughly. And the other 50%, they actually listen to your call and then they actually help you out. So it really depends. That bot lane looks like super, super juicy to like TP2, man. But uh, I can't really TP because the wave is like stacking, so... Hmm, he's standing really far away, so I can't really touch him. But I'm just gonna push it in. We're getting pretty close now. Place a ward over here. Probably get a nice jump on him. Nice. Nice try. Got my Q again in like two seconds. Oh, okay, we can dive him under tower now. He's dead. If he tries, I'll stop him. But just see, we're, we're, we're not giving that Graves the even the chance of of like farming on our tower. I love how I'm getting ganked like several times and it's not even working like one single time. Not even once. <laughs> this guy's is coming back and coming back and coming back, but his ganks always fail, man. <laughs> he spends like so much time like already trying to gank our lane and just nothing worked out for him. Surprise, I'm back. We push. Awesome. Now we take the final plate, actually. Or, well, not the final plate. I mean, the, the, the whole tower. We're taking the tower like 10 minutes in the game, by the way. That's incredible. It's like the earliest tower we can have. And now we go back. So this time, we're going to buy Blade of Boom King. And after Blade, we'll... Uh, We'll get my steel caps. It's on. 
This Graves is still here. I'm just going to TP for it. Stop this guy. Let's push it out. Usually, I'm not a huge fan of TPing like this. But in this case, I just want to pressure him out. So after di uh, after the, the blade, we're going to get a Define Sunner on the next one. So that's a massive fight on mid lane. We'll see what we can do to stop this stuff. I'll, I, I could basically just flank them on the back. Surprise. I'll get this one so he can't use it anymore. We're about to flank this game from the back. Is Leona taking damage on her tower? What is he doing? What is she doing? <laughs> what What is she thinking? I got you. This Leona was like tanking like three uh, three hits. Huh. Well, we can get some more plays now. Yeah, we're holding so much pressure in the game now. My teammates are not necessarily that useful. My bot lane is in fact actually behind on the enemy right now. But uh, our lead is growing so massive now, they can't stop me anymore. I got you. Now we push. Here's my corrupting pot so we can get the mana. Ready for battle. Let's push out the next wave. Take all of this stuff. Now it's my turn. And we go back. So now we go for a Define Sunder. And let's take the Sheen. I'll take the Kindle Gem so we are a little bit more tanky. I'm also going to take Red Trinket right now. Uh, because we're going to have to clear down those uh, those wards when we try to flank someone. And let me just change this real quick. There we go. That's better. In case you wonder what I'm doing here, I always have the C button uh, being used for pots, for wards, and stuff like that. But when I play Jax, I always change the hotkeys around. So I can jump with the trinket using my C button. And eventually, I change the, the trinket to the red trinket. I can just change it back. Yeah. Oh, he's dead. I got you. And we're going to move back to mid lane. And we'll see if we can... Oh, never mind. Let's go back top. So the only thing I'm actually very interested in right now is getting a blue buff. <laughs> I know it sounds super strange. Like, what are you doing with a blue buff on Jax, right? But uh, what I personally always like to do when I snowball games like this is getting a blue buff and then constantly pushing and using all my abilities to farm up jungle camps, you know? So that's the reason why I love blue buff so much on Jax. He's dead. He just given up. He knows he dies. Another wave. Awesome. Let's take down the golems. We'll see if we can take the red. Apparently this ward is still down here. For some reason. Awesome. I hope that the red buff is going to be here. I would be very happy with the red buff, actually. No. <laughs> nice ward, though. We can dive him on our tower, maybe. He's kind of like accepting the fact that he's going to get dove on our tower already, so he's walking back. <laughs> I 
I love to see this, man. Ah, that's very good down. If we had mana right now, oh, imagine. We we killed we killed their cane in one second. Right? I had to pop my ultimate, which given me uh which dropped like 100 mana. But imagine if I didn't pop my ultimate, I would have mana enough to like maybe get another catch, but at the same time I would probably die because I wouldn't have the armor. But uh <laughs> that was actually pretty close. <laughs> Could have had a triple there if I had like enough mana, but um We're gonna TP top again. Do the same stuff. I was going to pressure him. I don't care about my TP at all, man. I don't care about it. All I want to do right now is just pressure. Speed running the game, right? Let's get this camp here. We can die from under tower. We got that stuff. Push this out. That's like one combo, by the way. We didn't even pop the pot or anything like that. There's uh, some other guy coming top lane now. So we're going to have to go back. Might get flanked by someone. Also, quick questions. Very mana hungry though, yeah. You you have to know that if you play Jax, that <laughs> Jax takes a lot of mana for everything. Jax is eating up mana like it's nothing. But that's why we have the Corrupting Pot, you know, and the Biscuit Delivery. If you don't run Biscuit Delivery on Jax, you're going to be having permanent mana issues. Oh, you're dead. Well, you're dead. Nice try, though. We push next wave. Maybe we can uh, get the tower done as well. Hello, Draven. Hmm. <laughs> what is he? Wait, what? <laughs> I walked over to him. He just immediately W's away. <laughs> right on the second and this doesn't come back anymore. Okay, let's uh Oh, let's take a look and see. Ready for battle. Maybe we can get another catch. We got like 2.5. Awesome, let's go back. So this time we're gonna run uh wait, what? Let me at him. We're getting chased down by a Leona? Whoops. What is she doing? What is she doing? You guys are gonna die, man. <laughs> You're messing around with me too much. What are you guys doing? You're messing around with a Jax. Come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. What is he doing? Oh! He's not giving me the space. <laughs> I had the button for my ward, like, on the wrong button, man. Alright, let's go back. <laughs> I could have technically killed Draven with my jump. If, uh, if I did it earlier. You know, things would have been uh, different, actually. I tried jumping on Falcos. It didn't work. He just kept running. Surprise, okay, let's take some more waves. We're going to do the same thing on repeat. We're just constantly going to push lane over and over again. 
push it all the way to the tower. Now it's my turn. Nice. Push this out. Okay. That's a massive team fight going to appear on Drake now. I'm gonna help out, even though I actually wanted to run top lane, but uh, this is fine too. Well. Get another one. Oh, I get. Oh, they got canceled. Wow. That Draven Evil is like perfection, man. It canceled my Q. <laughs> not bad from him. Not bad from him at all. He uh, managed to lose this team fight, which is super interesting. I actually nearly 1v9 did. I wonder what happened to my team, actually. I'll sell this. I need my team to go Baron now. This Graves is totally useless. Look at this. <laughs> He's got a shield bow and that's it. <laughs> we're literally like... We're literally 23 minutes in the game and all he has is a shield bow. That you could basically buy like... 10 minutes in. Hey Dave, thanks for the videos, bro. Big fan from... Oh, from there. Okay. I'm glad you're enjoying it, man. Nice. We can maybe get another jump off. Well... Okay, I hope there's a blue buff. Yeah, there's a blue buff. Awesome. I'll take this though. I bet you they're pro he's probably going to try to steal it. Oh, we get we're going to get some patches. Yep. Guys down. And he's dead. This Graves is like no damage. <laughs> you know, he does like a Q and auto. It does like 200 damage at most. <laughs> I don't even build like tank. All I have is an ultimate. And a level lead. Like 3 level lead. He does not damage anymore. Just a Leona. Okay. Well. Well, we can get some catches. Oh, I was really expecting Fagar to stun them before they could jump on me. I was having my expectations on Fagar here to do it properly, but he was too late. Let's go for Garden Central. Let's take, um... We have one more item to go for. I'm personally thinking about maybe... Getting a Wit's End. But I think I'd rather go for Death Stance because Draven is way more fed than this Lily I would ever be. So we're going to go for this stuff. Our team comp is incredible. I'm just very surprised that it's actually been a hard game for my team so far. Bring it on. This Draven is dead. 
Uh, Volibear does not pay attention to what's happening, I think. Okay, we got him. How do you push mid lane? Jack's ultimate is so OP. <laughs> if you press R, you gain so much armor. Very impressed that most people don't even know. Um, are you playing any kill today? Um, probably not. Maybe tomorrow. Like, kill's being planned out very soon, so... Let's take this camp. Oh, that's tanking already. My team is just walking everywhere. I really want my team to go for Baron. Like, I want to. I'm actually getting full build very soon, but my team is, like, all over the place. That's another team fight starting now. Real quick. I got him. Ah, uh, this Vager has TP, but he never used it. I was fully relying on Vager TPing, but he never TP'd. This guy is TP, dude. This guy has TP the whole fight through. He just kept pushing. He never TP'd. He never TP'd. He just kept pushing. What on earth are you doing? What are you What are you split pushing for if you're not using TP? I don't get it, man. Okay, whatever. I'm gonna I'm gonna have to push split push myself, man. This, this Vega is not gonna use TP. Ever. It's like a show. I'll I'll just go ball in myself. Push it out myself. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna expect my Vega to TP again like this. He just doesn't use it. Okay, let's go. This Graves is... <laughs> two items. <laughs> Just two items. Hopefully we can get a catch here. I'm hoping that Graves is going to walk in here so I can kill him, but uh, he's not going to show up, I guess. I'm gonna leave this way. Um, I'm gonna leave this the way it is, and group at Baron now because my team is actually grouping for it. Gotta get ready for this stuff. So fed and yet like we are not winning those team fights. It's just because my team has been playing it wrong. Probably, yeah, it's gonna walk away. Tony lost. All we had is like one catch. The owner ran away. My team is weak, man. We get such a strong LA game, and yet my team doesn't win it. My team is just missing the damage to do it. Got like the perfect team comp for this actually. Ready for battle. There we go. We can buy my last item now. We're full build. Take this stuff out. I'm telling you, the the play that Fager made with the TP basically made us like lose. Up to this point now. The, because Faker didn't take the TP earlier. 
it made things pretty terrible. Let me at him. It's a blue cane. What is he doing? <laughs> oh, really? He's flashing out. Yeah, that's that's blue cane right there. That's what that's how cane players always do it. They just they they do something random like walking in your jungle, and then he just flashes out after he gets caught. They got a Baron without the jungler. Eighteen seconds or fifteen seconds for us to get a uh, to get the Drake right now. Okay, time to make the play of the game. This Drake is going to make the entire change. Yep, this Drake is ours. They have no Joner there. Yeah, awesome. We finally have it. It seems like we do not have to TP for it. I got him. At least we got the graves. We might be able to push up to the in-head now. Ready for battle. <laughs> Last try. We could probably finish here. Nice try, Leona. Hmm. Okay, sure. See you later. I wish that I wish that my team was here once again, but they're farming at the base. You know, I wish they would made some effort to at least try like walking up to the base here, so maybe we could push ourselves and get something, you know? I'm very satisfied with the, how this game is running so far. It's kind of been like a more like a one man in, in this whole game, you know, so far. We can replace that and go for hole breaker now. We'll take it as the final item. I'm just gonna straight up like TP top lane now. Oh, I should have bought a red pod. Whoops. Oh, my team is going to get all in. I hope my teammates are not going to get all in now. Here we go. Yep, my teammates are getting all in right now. All they had to do was play it safe. And not getting caught by it. How sad is that? Ah, uh, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna die here now. Oh, my team only has one job, guys. This game. My team only has one single job in this whole game straight, and that's just to, like, not die. <laughs> not die. I knew, I told you guys the moment I would TP down here, the enemy team would see that I'm top lane. They, they would just push... That would just directly all in my team and then they get caught. You know, that's literally what I predicted would happen, you know. They just had to not die, like that's it. That would be the end of the game right there. It's unbelievable how hard this game is with a Fager mid lane and a Volibear jungle. 
with an, a fell cost and an astral ADC. Like, it's unbelievable how we actually can't win this game. <laughs> Let's go for a red pod now. Ooh. Kill him. Fight him. Oh, he should have just autoed and queued him then afterwards. He queued and then autoed. Yeah. Well, I can't, uh, I can't really believe what's this, to be honest. Gets caught as well. Oh, man. this oh, They're all getting caught, man. Oh, they're all getting caught. Oh, let's take a look at this. I, I can't believe what I'm witnessing now. Oh, they all die again. Ah, oh, that's so sad. I can't change it for them. We got him too. Can we finish the game here? My my TP is like 25 seconds right now. Uh, I wish I was faster, man. Look look how look how slow we are. No 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 no! Don't go for blue buff. No. Don't go for blue buff. Look at the wave. What is he doing? Just walk to base. Walk to the enemy base. We kill the Draven. That's it. What is he doing? Why is he staying in mid lane? What is he doing? I don't get it right now. Where is Ezreal? I'm seriously asking, where is he going? He's on drink. What is he doing? He's on Drake. What is he doing, guys? Where is this guy? What is, what is going on? How could he not possibly see it? I even spam ping the base. All we have to do is kill Drake and then he's finished. Another opportunity we lost. What is this, man? You can definitely tell that League of Legends is a team game. <laughs> this is literally a team game, man. You <laughs> this game. I don't need my team to make sick plays. All I need them is just to, 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 to force... The base, you know, finishing it up, wrapping up the game, you know. <clears throat> All right. Awesome. Progress. Now we have to actually turn up a team fight. Five, five, uh, five versus five now, because Ezra didn't take the opportunity before. Oh wow, that actually land. Okay, we got it. Oh man, this teammate is so hard. Wow. So hard they made it. Could have been finished like 20 minutes ago, but whatever. I'm really disappointed in how the game turned out. Like it could have been an instant win like so long ago.
<laughs> but uh, anyway, guys, this is Jack's top lane. This game was also being played live on stream. So I stream every single day. You know, link inside the description below the YouTube video. Make sure to check it out. But uh, with that being said, thank you so much for being here on today's YouTube video. And I'll see you next time. Peace.